Hey Doug, this is Frank from Max Digital and I wanted to shoot you over this quick video with some specific things that you guys can do uh, yourself to help bring in more business just by better utilizing your website. Uh, so I had looked at your site here and I noticed that um, you have a good amount of content on here. Uh, you actually have more content than uh, your number one competitor online does, uh, at least in the, on the search that I had looked at. And that's usually one of the uh, factors that Google looks at to determine who the expert is or who the authoritative site should be. Um, and so when I look at this uh, Google search here, I noticed you, you service the Jackson, New Jersey area. So I had done a, a search for dry vent cleaning in Jackson, New Jersey, and this is the search results page that comes up. And since 90 percent of the people never click past the first page, uh, you want to make sure that you're showing up on here. And so. I know that you aren't located in Jackson. Uh, I had looked at your Google business profile and saw that uh, you are in a nearby town. I think I saw somewhere on here. Um, so is, if, if you have another, uh, if you have an office in the Jackson area, you could get your um, another Google business profile set up uh, for Jackson. That will definitely help you to rank in that, uh, in that area into the map pack. Uh, I noticed, I think it was Howell that you are actually showing up in the map pack area, which is the second section down here. So there's three sections to the page. The top is the Google advertisers. So if you're not looking to pay Google advertising dollars, then you'd want to get into the map pack and the uh, organic listing down below. So I just wanted to show you, uh, you are in the map pack for Howell uh, and, and for Jackson. Uh, you can rank higher. Uh, I don't know that you'll get to the first page unless you set up another uh, profile for, uh, for Jackson. Um, but as far as the organic section down here, goes the ranking here is based on the strength of your content and your backlinks profile and so i wanted to just compare your content and backlinks to this pro clean new jersey which is the number one ranking uh dryer vent cleaning site in the jackson north Car uh, new jersey area so I let's just take a look and compare the two here um as i had mentioned uh, you have a great site here with a lot of content on it um what, what I think the reason why uh, he's outranking you is two reasons. One is your content needs to be filled with local buyer intent keyword phrases. So keyword phrases are just the phrases that you want your audience to find you online for. Uh, so you want to, since you're a service provider, have your keyword phrases uh, be what's known as local buyer intent, meaning that they reference both the service that you provide and the location that you provide that service in. And so I looked at, I use this site here called Arifs uh, to just look at different websites. So here's your site right here. And I see your work, uh, you're ranking for 15 different keywords. And so the top uh, couple two are not uh, local buyer intent keywords because they don't reference the city in it. These other ones, uh, Vent Cleaning Howell, New Jersey, Vent Cleaning Howell, Dryer Vent Cleaning Jackson, those are all local buyer intent keyword phrases, um, which Google over time, can recognize that you service uh, that area and, and provide that particular service. And so you will eventually start ranking for those keyword phrases. Um, but where you rank, you can see here, this uh, column over here shows you that you're ranking, you know, kind of at the end of page two, beginning of page three for these, and maybe end of page three for this one down here. Um, and that's uh, because you don't really have the phrase in your in your content all that frequently uh, so what you want to do is is embed into your content I know you do have like here it says the towns that you are servicing but we'll you see a lot of uh, companies will actually have like a specific location page for each uh, location that they service and the reason they do that is because it allows you to use the service that you're providing and the location those local buyer intent keyword phrases i was talking about it allows you to use them frequently on the same page and that allows google to see your content and say oh that's definitely what that search is looking for because it's got it listed several times uh you want it, your content to be dense in those local buyer intent keyword phrases so anyway let's look, take a look at your competitor your competitor again uh was uh, this Pro Clean New Jersey, and you can see they do have a back page here. Let's take a look at what what their back page is. See that exactly? They have uh, a page specifically for Jackson, uh, New Jersey, and a lot of companies do that. Like I said, they have multiple pages covering all the different cities that they service, and that's the reason why because 
when you look at this back page here, uh, ProClean Connect proclean.connect.com their jackson new, Jer uh, new jersey page it's got all these local buyer intent keyword phrases they're ranking high um, because they have everything's laid out specific for jackson and they do that like i said for every every city they service so you you would want to do the same thing because if you do you can see uh, the volume column here this shows you the number of searches per month on each of these keyword phrases and so you, you know there's different services that you're providing that all show up on their Jackson page um, and there you know you you could have it like I said a separate page for each city and, and be able to participate in all the volume for each of the different cities uh, this KD columns super important here um, because KD of zero means it does not take uh, very much or to to get um, ranking on the first page so that would be a recommendation I would have for you is to set up location pages. The other thing you want to do is, and the other reason why they could be outranking you potentially, let's just take a look here, is uh, your backlinks profile is important. So they don't have backlinks going to this site. They're beating you specifically or just because of the fact that they have uh, the separate Jackson page. Um, but you would want to continue to add to your backlinks here, um, it, it, especially in cities where maybe there's more competition. Backlinks are just links from other websites over to your website, and they just act as an endorsement of your site. And you want to beat your competition in both quantity and quality of backlinks. Uh, some links or some sites that you could be linked to uh, are more spammy in nature, and some are more authoritative. Google likes you likes it and rewards you when uh, you are ranked to uh, legitimate sites or, or sites that they view as a trusted site or another relevant uh, authoritative site. So you know you're in a for SEO, you want to continue to add uh, to your backlinks profile, and you can tell which sites are good by the DR. Every site has a DR score, and so uh, good, a really good site is a uh, DR score of 30 or higher. And so your backlink profile, even though you only have eight, is pretty good. Um, uh, but I would say continue to add to that, and that will help you in the uh, ranking. You can see they're like I was showing you, they're ranking uh, even though they have the, have the DR score of eight. Uh, with zero backlinks, so they're getting a little bit of power here uh, from their homepage. Um, so anyway, uh, I hope that information was helpful. Uh, if you have any questions, feel free to reach out. Uh, if you wouldn't mind just rep replying to the email to let me know if the information was valuable so that I can continue to add value to small businesses, I'd greatly appreciate that. Thanks, and I look forward to hearing from you. Have a great day.